In today's video tutorial, I will show you how to make beautiful project in Irish lace technique. For work you need matte painting on the paper, pin scissors, balls of yarn, cords, beads, flowers, Let's begin the work. Make a picture in real size and pin it on the mat. Now I pin my cord. I have already done the first leaf or petal. Then you should pin in this way the next pattern. I have pinned the pink cord. Now I'm going to pin the white cord. As you can see, I leave big pieces of white color of yarn to sew cords together in the places of contiguity. I cut off my cord. I will cut here. Then you should remove all yarn of the cord. Now I show you how to remove all yarns of the cord. Here how it looks and pin it. Continue the work. I take the third cord. As you can see, I made this cord of blue color of yarn. You can make it of other color of yarn. I attached my white cord and put the blue cord under the white one. Now I pin them.
like this. Then you should sew all places of contiguity. In this case, I will use thread and needle. I use the thread from the cord. With the needle go through the stitches. 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 I have sewn all places of contiguity here, 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 and here, here, and in this side. I don't cut off this yarn. We are working on the front side of the project. Now I will work with flower. I pin this flower on the pattern. Pin it. And you should sew this flower to the cords in the places of contiguity. Here, here, in this case you should sew inside. Here, and here. We have sewn all places of contiguity here, 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 and here. Now I show you how to fill it up all three places with the mesh. And brights. As you can see, I don't sew my cord, I just pin it. I have been at my court. Let's make brights. With a needle go through the stitches along the court till the point where you will begin first bright.
with the needle go through the stitch of the cord. And let's begin the base for the bright. With the needle go through the stitch of the cord. With the needle go through the stitch of the cord on the opposite side. The second base is ready. With the needle go through the loop. We have made three strings or three base. Now I will wrap these three. Pull a little bit Rub the thread I have made brides With the needle go through the stitch. I secure this bright with the needle go through the stitch till the point where we will, will start to make the second bright. Make the next bride by yourself. I have done all brides. As you can see, I add one more bride. You can remove it or, or just add as I did. Now I show you how to fill up this place. I secure this cord. I will work with mesh. I begin from this side and work with down to the up. Make a chain, insert the hook into the loop. Make a chain. Chain of three, one, two, three. I retouched my cord. I retouched my cord. I skip the next stitch, insert the hook into the second stitch. And make single crochet. Continue working, chain three for the chain space. We'll skip the next stitch, insert the hook into the second stitch, insert the hook into the stitch. Make single crochet. Chain one, two, three, 
two, three. We skip the next stitch, insert the hook into the second stitch. Let's repeat again. And make single crochet. One, two, three, Insert the hook into the corner. Make single crochet. Chain. Insert the hook into the stitch. Make a slip stitch. Let's repeat again. Work in backwards direction one, two, three chains. Insert the hook into the chain space. Two rounds of work. Chain of three for the chain space. Insert the hook into the chain space. Make single crochet. Chain one, two, three. Insert the hook into the chain space. Make single crochet chain of three for the chain space. One, two, three. I'm about to complete the second row, chain of three, insert the hook into the side loop and make a slip stitch. I lost my loop. Let's repeat again. Let's stop and look what we have. Here what we have. So continue working in this way till the end of the space. I have done mesh till the sum parts. Now I show you how to make the grease. I remove my pins. Make a chain. Insert the hook into the second stitch.
chain of two insert the hook into the chain space make single crochet chain of three one two three insert the hook into the chain space make single crochet insert the hook make a chain we we'll skip the next stitch insert the hook into the second stitch make a slip stitch I lost my loop pull up the working loop remove the hook insert the hook into the stitch take the working loop pull it through like this chain of two pull up the working loop remove the hook insert the hook into the chain space take the working loop pull it through chain of two I work with this side insert the hook into the stitch make a slip stitch let's repeat again chain one I will work with this side chain we skip the next stitch insert the hook into the second stitch make a slip stitch chain of two insert the hook into the stitch insert the hook into the chain space make single crochet continue chain of two insert the hook into the stitch now I remove the hook insert the hook into the stitch or side loops take the working loop pull it through continue the work chain of two one two insert the hook into the stitch I remove the hook insert the hook into the stitch Take the working loop, pull it through. Chain one, two. I lost my loop. 
let's repeat again chain one two make the third one insert the hook into the stitch on the opposite side make a slip stitch make a chain and let's complete the work here I cut off my yarn and the mesh is ready you should remove this yarn to the back side or along the cord let's look at our work as you remember I choose where I need to join on one side as another one. Continue working with the second part of this tutorial. Rachel Boutique is the unique, stylish, handmade clothing studio of Elena Rugel. Together with purchasing ready clothes, you can also order any model you like at the boutique to be made special for you. Thanks for watching!